Okay. Um. Okay. So we are getting are uh, getting very close. Um. Uh, to the end of this interview, and uh, and I just want to um talk about uh, Nelson Sutherland, who I personally admire, and um and respect his work, and and I had, um a chance to go to um the exhibit, uh, I've got the name of it. I'm sorry. Um, it was um at his oh, yeah, his you place. Saw the Nelson, saw, you saw, you saw the Nelson Sullivan show. And your yeah. photographs was in display there. Um, two. The last day was on August tenth. Now I went there for my birthday. I would had. I was so thankful. I had a chance to 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 go there. I, actually, it was my birthday, so it was for me personally. I I really was thankful to um to be there. And so, John, you uh, how did you meet on on uh, Nelson? I think I said uh, that the first time I met him was at the tunnel when yeah. they were. Uh, either checking out the space, literally, like it was. It was on the landing. The, the tunnel basement was a big staircase, a landing, and then a, another way going down. And it was taken there, and and that's what I uh, on first shot, I think. And again, if someone's for, you, you meet somebody, you meet somebody. You're instant friends, and you're in a sense because. Yeah. You're not, you're, it's acknowledged that he, they're doing something. He had his, I think he had his camera with his video camera. I'm taking his picture. So you, you it's like you don't have to warm up to anybody. You, know, you meet them, you've met them. I, I, I like that, that quote. Sense. I like that. I'm, I'm going to quote you on that. I like that phrase. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, I love that. Um, So uh, uh, Nelson Sullivan, from, from what I know as a, as a viewer, um, I w- obviously I wasn't um there at 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 that time, but um, uh, his last video was on July third, and his he passed away for what I know of, um, from a heart attack on July fourth, nineteen eighty nine. Um, nineteen eighty nine. Eighty nine. Eighty nine. Yeah. How did you react to that of his passing? I just I heard it. In- Stephen Lewis's office at the Red Zone, I think Larry T told me, and that was it's, it's, you know it was sad. He was he was uh, he was older than everybody else, but he was only forty. Um, I think, or maybe you know, he was forty five. Um, you know, and again, you know, again, you know, it, you, you know, uh, somebody's uh, nice and friendly, and uh, it's it's it's. Um, you don't expect you know people yeah. to be dying at that point, even though there was so much die death with the with the AIDS crisis. Do you know uh, what would happen to um, um, Blackout, his dog? Do you do, 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 do you know? Uh, no, I don't know things. I don't okay. know things like that. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. um, they, uh, and also, you know, like I was friends with everybody, but I wasn't like. Um, I don't, you know, people weren't inviting me for dinner or anything. Like, I was still, like, a, in a, in like, a, uh, where, meaning, like, you know, my job, I, I took it upon myself to just document the scene, but I, um, I didn't maybe need, have a need to, like, oh, you know, smooth people to the point where, um, you know, I would be doing too much outside of the scene. That's, I guess, the point. I, I would only, uh, saw these people anybody from you know except for Rebecca Alec when I was doing stuff and, and articles and stuff mm-hmm. but generally but again there's the nightclub scene and then there was the how would you describe it, the media scene and media no uh, midtown uh, the publishing events uh, crazy promotional parties celebrity uh, gatherings stuff that had nothing to do with nightclubs or club kids, or drag queens. That's yeah. the other half of my archive. Um, yeah, yeah. And yeah, I mean, like you know, tributes to Sidney Poitier. You very you know, di- and, di- and diverse in your in your work. Yeah, yeah. Because I was, I was, I, I was making a name for myself as photographer. Period. Not like a yeah. You're not pigeonholed. In, in one yeah. thing, I, I do understand that. I I, I hate it yeah. when people put me in one in one category, and they were like, "Oh my god!" But you do that? I like, yes, I, well, I do a lot of things. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I don't want to say like I dabbled in everything, but I, 
yeah, yeah. Way. And again, I, 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 I regret that I didn't go out every to every one of these sort of cheesy, mm-hmm. silly yeah. club kid parties because um, it, it doesn't matter what the parties for or about. I realize now what my what I was doing was just, you know, making a record of these people and basically, you know, they're fabulous. Nobody's in their outfits because that was, it was all about going out and seeing people, showing off, I mean, um, expressing yourself. I mean, I joke about the club kids that they didn't wear the same outfit more than once. Wow. Because a lot of times they would go shopping at Goodwill. This is like Larry T and RuPaul and Michael Alec and Michael Muscle. You can just imagine like the, the tackiest, I mean, the, the tackiest, gaudiest, you know, yeah. retro kind of outfits and or, uh, shirts or sweaters or dresses. And it's great because they make a statement or whatever and then you don't, They'll never wear that again. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, but it's um, from 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 the yeah. I, yeah. Yes, go ahead. I say like I never dress. I mean, I wore boat. I wore sport coats. I wore my leather jacket. I I had like a generic working uniform in a sense. It wasn't my job to dress up. Nobody ever photographed me. I photographed myself lots of times with uh, lots of people, yeah. but um. It was, it was, it wasn't my job to be uh, a dress up person. Okay, great. Um, I just want to say again, um, uh, John, I I thank you so so much for the experience because um, I I do in my YouTube for your works and as a filmmaker, um, and uh, I'm not a photograph a photographer, but we are in the same field, so love and. And I and I do and I do respect your works and all the things that you you have done and I will leave, um, in the YouTube video and my website I will leave all all your information that you um can be contact, um your your website sure. you. and everything down there, okay. Okay. And, That's uh, great. Thank you so much, Richard. It's been fun. <laughs> it has been three. How long? How long we have, we have been speaking? Two for, hours. Two, two hours? hours. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. But all right, John. Have a, have a beautiful day. Okay. Stay safe. Okay, you too. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye.